All right, let's check in now with meteorologist Annalise Parks. She's got to look at the forecast. All right, Ken and Gilma, yeah, we're talking about the heat staying around North Texas. Lots of sunshine, humidity, of course, on the high side. And as we take a look on our radar, we've been trying to wait on some rainfall, and our rain chances have just stayed really slim to none. You can see some very isolated little storms that were across our extreme southeast. That was earlier on today, closer to midday, early afternoon. Those have since dried out. And as we go on through the rest of your afternoon, expecting those to stay well off to the south. So we'll stay dry looking overnight mostly clear but into the day on Tuesday more sunshine a little bit more cloud cover as still more humidity builds back in we will be watching a complex of storms back across northwestern portions of Texas models are trying to bring that in across the metroplex I think they're a little bit aggressive but a 20 percent chance of rain at best later on tomorrow night into early on Wednesday taking you to the tropics again Jose the latest barely hanging on to category one status as it does move north 10 miles per hour 250 miles east of Cape Hatteras and as we show you again it will stay in the Atlantic a little bit of rain across the northeast of course some really gusty winds riptide dangerous riptide a big concern for those folks anywhere from New York stretching up to Boston that will be what they're watching by the middle of the week and into Thursday all eyes are on Hurricane Maria though certainly the strongest a strong uh, hurricane at category four now 130 mile per hour winds max is staying moving off to the northwest and as you can see it will push across puerto rico wednesday just north of the dominican republic on thursday what does it do after that and what impact could it have for the u.s still several days away got to keep in mind about a week or so before we might see impact Right now, this is still a long way off, but right now, two models that we're looking at, the European takes it more out, keeping it in the Atlantic. The American model keeps it closer to the Carolinas, something that we'll be keeping an eye on in the coming days. Here in North Texas, we keep a quiet, hot forecast. Temperatures are back in the 90s today. Our above average trend stays around 94 DFW, Dallas 93. And our humidity is going to stay high. Dew points in the 60s, so it does feel like mid to upper 90s the coming days. A hot one again as we look ahead tomorrow. 77 degrees for tonight. Tomorrow's forecast, 97. So a slight bit hotter than what you saw today. And tomorrow night, we'll mention that 20% chance of an isolated shower or storm. Again, rain chances low through the week. Fall officially starts on Friday, guys. 92 degrees.